This is the Heston Q cooking system. Let's go through some of the features. This is the smart induction burner. Comes with a power cord and the three buttons. There's a power button, a power control bar, and a next button. Okay, if you want to use it manually without using the app, when you turn it on, you'll see kind of the white light. This is the power of the heat. And that's the next button, all related to the app. So I'll just turn it off for now so you can hear me better and also so I don't burn myself. Next, this is what I have, this smart cookware, 11 inch stainless steel pan. And so with this one, um, you can only use it with the smart induction burner, the Hessen Q burner, um, not to be used in your oven or on your stove. Um, so what's special about this, it actually has a AAA battery that's inside. Um, you can put in the dishwasher as long as the this little seal is very tight and also has a smart capsule inside. Okay. And this one you see right here also has a battery inside. This is the Heston Q Smart Probe. Great for temperatures if you're you know, cooking candy, meat. Uh, again, just used for Heston Q um, pens and pots and the system. It comes with a little bracket and how you use that is you clip it on to your cookware and then it stays up. So we'll do a quick demo. Ta-da! And there's a little ruler which you can use to measure your food to know the thickness of certain proteins. And it also has a guide on the other side in terms of measurement. So one pinch equals one eighth teaspoon as an example. So the unique thing with the smart capsule and, and this whole system is that it syncs up to your app and uh, we'll do a demonstration of how that works. Um, and it's smart enough that it will tell you when to flip your food and cook it to the right temperature. So I definitely want to put this to a test. So I've downloaded the Hessen Q app and I've synced up all my equipment to the app and I'm good to try out my very first recipe. So let's do something easy. And um, let's say scrambled eggs. This is what it looks like. And then with all the recipes, there's actually a video. We're going to scrambled eggs, which is a breakfast staple. We're going to start by whisking the yolks and the whites until we form a smooth consistency. For this recipe, it's really important that we gently fold the eggs into the center of the pan until we form. And they ask for servings. They give you instructions. So let's try this out. So the app. It's telling me to prepare my burner by pushing the start button and the next button. Let's do that together. Oh. So it's getting it up to the right temperature. Next, add butter and melt it. Oops. Let's do that together. I'm going to press the next step. Add your eggs. And they say to fold it in. Right? Fold it in. Ooh. 
Yes, I am recording and cooking at the same time. <laughs> Salt. All right, here you go. I am going to plate that. All right, putting this in. Woo! <laughs> I'm actually gonna put a splatter guard. All right, next stop is to flip it. Moment of truth. Can I do this? <laughs> Ooh, gorgeous. Next, I've added thyme, smashed garlic, some butter, and some vegetable oil, and I'll be basting that. 